so welcome. Thank you all for coming tonight. It's really a nice crowd. Um, the topic for the satsang tonight is heartache. I did not pick this, so I don't. I think he did. I did. Yes. Um, so I was um, <laughs> <laughs> sitting in meditation today and thought, okay, heartache. Heart, what's heartache? Um, and um, as I was just kind of letting the word the word roll through my body and my mind and through my energy, um, I was like, it, it felt like okay, it's really heartache is really something that we physically feel, um, not so much because of a physical reaction, but much more of an emotional reaction. I think heartache is is the most physical emotion that we can feel. It's a sensation, it's maybe not the nicest, not the most pleasant, but it's a very intense sensation. It's a very lively sensation. It tells you you are alive. Even if you're feeling like this is not how I want to feel, at the same time it tells you I'm really alive. Um, and as I, I as I was just progressing through, okay, you know, how do I feel with heartache? What does heartache mean to me? Um, it's like heartache to me is a longing. It's not so much pain. I know it's physical pain, but to me, it's much more of a longing. The longing for fulfillment, the longing for something that I'm missing, the longing for being whole. The longing for everything is okay. That's what heartache means to me. And it's like my heart is telling me, you are missing out on something. Something is not right in your life. There is a part of you that's somewhere where it's not supposed to be. There is an energy that you're giving where you're not supposed to be giving. There is maybe a pain you're feeling. Not so much because someone inflicts it on you, which is, of course, what we connect it with but much more because you're missing something. And to me, missing something does not have anything to do with anyone else. It does not have anything to do with the person. It does not have anything to do with a matter, you know, nothing tangible. Much more to do with me. What am I missing? For me, it's like, what am I missing in my life? Who am I missing? And that person can only be me. There's a part of me I'm really, really, really missing. That's what heartache is to me. And somebody that can inflict heartache on me, or a situation that inflicts heartache on me, to me means, um, or it's like God's way or myself really showing me, here, you have to look here, look here. Mm. You're not looking. You're not paying attention to what I'm trying to tell you on a nice level. You know, you will only listen when there is pain involved. Because that's, I mean, that's often how I listen, is when there's pain involved, and I'm willing to look. Because yeah, as everybody, you know, everybody's busy, and, and life is life, and you have to do this and that and the other, and then there's always something else. And as soon as there is an ache or pain, I will listen. Because it's like, okay, I have to focus my attention there. And I think heartache is one of the greatest pains we can experience. Because it's something that does not relate to the physical so much. It's not like, oh, you know, I, I worked out too hard, so I have muscle soreness. Or, oh boy, I bent over too much, my back hurts. It's, it's much more of a inflicted by something. By an emotion, by a, a tragedy, by... Oh no, just just an yeah, just a happening. So it's something that really, really makes you look. Okay, what do I do now? First of all, you, you we say, okay, I want to get rid of it. But if you instead of saying, oh, I need to get rid of it, let's let me get rid of it. I don't want this heartache. Instead of saying that, we could just as well say, and that's something I, I try to do with myself is, okay. Yes, it's, it's not very comfortable. Yes, it's painful. What's it telling me? What is it saying? What is it saying? Is it saying, look, where does it say look? Um, 
not so much how do I get, do how do I get rid of, but so much more like, thank you, I appreciate. It. Thank you, heartache, for showing me a way that I've not been seeing. Thank you for saying something I've not been listening to. Thank you for making sure that you're so intense that I don't have a choice but to listen. And then embracing it. And as soon as I can embrace it, I can let it go. So for me, heartache is a very valuable lesson to learn. Not that I'm saying I want to inflict it on anyone or I wish it on anyone, but at the same time, just from my own experience and the way I can look at it, is I am grateful. I am grateful for heartache. I'm grateful for my body basically telling me, hey, pay attention. Listen to yourself. Look at yourself. Look at the path you're taking. Are you really where you need to be? And I think that at that moment when I can listen, that heartache will start to heal. It will let me be. It will give me the necessary direction I need to go in. It will give me a push. It's like a little kick in the butt. You know, say, no, now, now is time. Because if you don't, things might get worse. So as soon as I acknowledge you, we can say, okay, 